Everybody, welcome to my channel. I hope everybody is doing well today. We're doing good over here on my side. Me and my family, we're doing okay. We're doing good. So today, guys, I am having a stuffed turkey leg. Fredo shrimp. It's a Fredo shrimp stuffed turkey leg. This, I got inspired by the turkey leg hut out of Houston, Texas. Oh, I said if I ever go down to Texas and eat one of their turkey legs, this is the one I want to try. Because this is the one that caught my attention when I'm looking at their menu. The stuffed Alfredo stuffed turkey leg, the shrimp. Oh, it has spinach in it. And you know, you saute the red onions and all of that. I'm just going to buy what I think is in it. But I did see spinach on top of shrimp when I put the the uh what you call it the um purple onions and all of that i sauteed them as well and oh, i'm kind of excited about this because this will be the first time i ever tried something like this this is something to try this is amazing i mean i was amazed by looking at them how they got so many of those stuffed turkey legs they have so many they got other different flavors as well but one day i'm gonna make it down to texas and i'm gonna try it myself I really am. I'm going to try it myself. But I'm just doing my little version of it. Because they have inspired me, Turkey Lead Hut, to want to go to drive to Texas. But right now, you know, dealing with this pandemic. So I'm not really traveling too much right now. But let me say a prayer and then we'll get into the business. Amen. So have y'all have it, have y'all ever heard of the turkey leg hut out of Houston, Texas? It's so many people I see uh, putting that's talking about it on Facebook and everywhere. So I said, let me you know what. Let me try my own inspired version of it. Let me try my own. So let me try. It might not be as tender as theirs because I don't think I cooked it long enough but let me try this would be something if they had one close by us mm -hmm. mm. that's good That is really good. That is really good, guys. I hope 
hope y'all are enjoying this as well. Or try it yourself. Make it. Mm -hmm. It's really good. They're really famous. I think they started their business. It's a husband, husband and wife business. Don't quote me. I believe they did. I believe they started their business back in 2015. Okay. Is it anything like this, which I know it would be better? Oh man. Mm. You know, I'm I'm game for anything that's a with a turkey leg. I love turkey legs. all about stuff in a turkey leg. I know people, well, I used to cook them years ago and smoke them on a grill. Years got me like the, the, like the early part of the 90s, mid 90s. But man, this has really taken it to another level. This is taking it to another level. They got one with the mac and cheese. I'd love to try that one too. I ever make it down to Houston, Texas, believe me, I'm going by there. This is the business, honey. This is delicious. Guys, this is so good. Mm, 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 mm. Wow. Great. I, I said to myself, you know what? I know I can't make it down there right now. I'm not going to be able to make it. So for this pandemic, let me try to make it myself. Oh. trying different meals anyway. I do I love trying different different recipes. Put it like that. This is the fat part. Too much care for the fat of the turkey. The skin I mean. I'm sorry the skin. Trying to get all my sauce off.
put my pretty tender to. Mmm. Pat myself on the back. It'd be pretty good. I got me some gold peak tea. Anybody have tried the turkey hut, the turkey leg hut? Please let me know. Mm. So baby, oh, mm. this is a great recipe to try. <clears throat> I would have never thought that putting Alfredo, shrimp Alfredo sauce on top of a turkey leg. See me, I ain't too much bother about the shrimp, right? It's really good. I bought my turkey legs from Walmart. I bake each one for my family as well. But I'm the first one trying it, so. It tastes good to me. I hope they like it. It tastes really good. The best way to make your own Alfredo sauce. Inspired by the turkey leg hood. Anybody watching this video that lives in Houston? You guys are fortunate to have them there. They need to put one either in Atlanta, Georgia, or come on to Columbia, South Carolina. Yes, we would love this. I would love to take a look here. 
They need to stay. That's a great combination. Taste that red onion in there and stand it. The sauce. I didn't make it spicy. I had a few flakes, a, a few um, red flakes. I saved my stomach for this. Just in case I liked it. Eat all of it and I do like it. Eat all of it and I'm getting it full. This is a this is a full one. This will fill you up. And the morning take the legs I see they have stuff. Theirs are huge. Theirs are really huge. Mm, mm, mm. So we're not. And my turkey just coming off so easy. I cooked it. It fell off the bone. Yes, it did. My turkey leg was cooked right on time. Cook about two and a half hours. I'm three fifty in the oven. All right, guys. I'm telling you, it tastes anything like this. You guys are the business. You are. This is the business, guys. I'm telling you, this is the business. This straight up business. delicious guys I just want to share with you all my version of Alfredo shrimp stuffed turkey leg <laughs> I wish you all could taste it it tastes so good they did if theirs tastes anything like this No, I can't get my words out right. I did excellent. I really enjoyed it. It was delicious. So I hope you all enjoyed it with me as well. And try it. Try the recipe. Try it. If you if you love 
making your own Alfredo sauce, which I think is better. Because you can add in what you want to put in it, like I did. And just, oh, wow. I never thought of this. Never thought of putting true Alfredo sauce on top of a turkey leg. <laughs> but when I saw their menu, I said, if I had to go there, there's two of them I want to try. The stuffed one, the stuffed turkey leg, um, Alfredo shrimp one or the macaroni and cheese. I want to try both of those. But next time I make the one with the mac and cheese on top. Hmm. <laughs> but anyway. Oh, I thank you all for joining me. I hope you all enjoyed this video just as much as I have enjoyed eating it with you all. And if you're new to my channel, thank you. Welcome. Welcome. Welcome to my channel. Don't forget to subscribe, tap the bell notification if you want to see more of my videos upload, and like this video. Give me the thumbs up and leave a comment. I love comments. I pray you all have a blessed day and a blessed night. Take care of yourself and take care of one another. I thank you all so much. I love you.